This is my short review of Train Coaster Grand Roller. Here's the box. And here's the back. I've already assembled it. And it sort of looks just like a picture. Uh, it takes three AAA batteries. And you can find this on Amazon and include the link. It's really easy to pop off the batteries on this thing. And assembling it isn't a, a problem at all. The bigger issue is the build quality. This was made by, I think, Shuye. Shuye Toy Factory. And I bought it for $20 at the local train fair at OC Fairgrounds. Uh, you can buy it on Amazon for about $16.50. They just, these trains just snap on to the track. It's easy to take off. And so if you want to replace the battery, it's just a matter of pulling off these tabs over here. And it gives access to the batteries. And so it's super easy. There's just one small tiny screw. So again, it's held on by these black tabs. One thing I'll show you is how it'll fall off. And you can see I'm pulling these uh, black rails or tabs out a little bit to show you a common problem with this toy. So let's see if I can put it on. So the toy itself is inexpensive and I don't think you should expect much in, in terms of build quality. Uh, it doesn't stand on well onto the ground. You can see that it's kind of loose and flimsy. Still though, uh, sometimes the parts will come loose and you have to fix it. So it's a, a noisy toy actually. Let's see. Turn it on on the side over here. And you see how it gets disconnected. Uh, there we go. So I thought the toy was broken. And I would take it apart and then try it again. And it just keep on falling off. So if you have the toy uh, again, back to these rails, all you have to do is just squeeze these, these mounts or rails or, I don't know what you call them, but just squeeze the black thingies so that when it comes onto the track, it'll be tighter and that'll fix your problem. I was about to return this. I was really bummed because it kept on falling off his track, but I did that. While it's on, you can try squeezing the thing again. And so let me put this to the side. Okay, let me try squeezing it some more. So all I'm doing is just squeezing these two together. Hopefully that fixes the problem. And now it's really fine. It's not falling off anymore after I squeeze it. And you can see over it, the piece fell off. If you take it apart, it's most likely it might break. And so, it's a pretty fragile toy set. Just be careful if you're gonna take it apart because the tabs, these are held together by two tabs. There's one going across here and those break really easily. And then there's the tabs over here. Those don't break, but I can imagine uh, one section of my thing 
over here, I've already had to glue back together, so hopefully this video is a little helpful. <laughs> I, forget to, I forgot to mention one last thing, that this toy lasts about 10 to 20 minutes with cheap batteries. I got my batteries, the double A's from a 99 cent store, and it lasts long enough. So anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes, 10 to 20 minutes.